Hello friends, welcome to my channel Skycam by Mr. Ray. Right now I am living in Canada and since last couple of days I got so many calls from friends, friends of friends regarding the point based system to get the permanent residency of Canada. At the same time I have been watching so many advertisements from the various agencies by the various agents and from the various consultancies. I personally felt that people have a misunderstanding regarding how to calculate the points for the permanent residency system and uh, those agency consultancies they are trying to misguide them. So here I come with the video of express entry point based system step by step procedure. Those who don't know what is the express entry let me tell you it's a point based system introduced by the Canadian government to get permanent residency directly of this country to the people who has the desired education and the enough work experience. So without wasting the time, let's get started. If you are new to my channel, please click on subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon for latest video. Thank you. Friends. To get the invitation from the express entry system, you must have these two things as in your profile. First, you must have to score 7 band in speaking, reading, writing and 8 band in listening module of IELTS English language test. Also, you must have a master degree plus 1 year of experience or bachelor degree plus 4 year of experience. These two things you can consider it as a threshold. If you don't have these two things as in your profile, believe me, your chances of getting the invitation through the express entry are very less. Let me explain you how to calculate the points in the express entry system step by step. As I said, I am going to show you step by step procedure to calculate your express entry point. I request you to see this video till the end and I will make sure that there will be no doubt left in your mind at the end of this video. So let's get started. First open Google homepage and search for CRS point calculator you will see first result as a comprehensive ranking system tool click on that you can find direct link in the description now this is the home page of CRS tool basically here First, they are asking you some of the basic questions and based on your answer, they will calculate your points. So, the first question is about your marital status. Are you married or single? Let's assume you are single. I will explain the changes if you are married in the later of the video. Let's move further to the next question which is about your age. Here let me clear one thing if you are a fall in between 18 to 35 years of age range you will get the same point. For assumption let's consider your age is 28. Next question is about your education. Here is the main thing. If you are applying internationally, you will have to go for credential assessment by applying to West Canada. 
वेस कैनेडा इज वर्ल्ड एजुकेशन सिस्टम विच विल कन्वर्ट योर इंटरनेशनल डिग्री इन टू दी कैनेडियन इक्विवेलेंसी डिग्री दिस प्रोसेस विल टेक फोर टू सिक्स वीक्स डिपेंडिंग अपॉन इन विच कंट्री यू आर अप्लाइंग फॉर यू कैन फाइंड द लिंक इन डिस्क्रिप्शन फॉर वर्ल्ड एजुकेशन सर्विसेस लेट्स मूविंग फर्दर आई एम एज्यूमिंग यू हैव अ मास्टर डिग्री Next question is about your Canadian degree. Have you studied in Canada or not? So our answer will be no. Here comes the main question about the language test. As I said, you need to give English language test. IELTS is most common among the all. With all that assumption, let's go further. The first question is are your test result less than 2 years old yes as per the cic rule your result should be latest by 2 years so select yes now the next question is which language test did you take we have already assumed it's ielts you have another option like cel pip and tef but the ielts is the most common one so i choose ielts further they are asking you score of each module remember that threshold i talked about in the beginning of this video you must have to score seven band in speaking eight band in listening seven band in reading and seven band in writing So let's put the score seven in speaking, eight in listening, seven in reading, and seven in writing. I will talk more about this score later in this video. The next question is about the second official language test. which is french in canada so our answer is not applicable okay let's moving further the next question is about your work experience this might be the tricky part many of you may do mistake here because of misunderstanding keep in mind they gonna ask you about two type of work experience the one is work experience in canada another is work experience from outside of canada also your work experience must fall under the national occupation classification category which are noc o a and b to check your noc follow the link in description so here the first question is about work experience in canada which is none or less than a year The second question is about work experience from outside of Canada. Let's say you have one year of experience. The next question is about certification from Canadian province. The answer is no. Next one is about job offer supported by LMIA. again the answer is no the next question is do you have a nomination certification from the province or the territory the answer will be no now this is the last question and it's about your relative in canada here they are asking you about your brother or sister by blood or by marriage your cousin brother or cousin sister will not count as a relative also your relative must be a canadian citizen or permanent resident then and then you will get extra points here so our answer is no and you are done here hit the calculate your score button and at the bottom your grand total is 444 
which is above the threshold of 430 plus as i said you might have a chance to get invitation for canadian permanent residency now as i said agents or consultancies they are trying to make you fool how let me explain they said you just need to score six band in each module of ilts and you will be eligible for express entry yes they are right you will be eligible but you will never get an invitation forgot about the six band in each even if you score 6.5 band in any of the module other than 7 you will be out of race let me show you how let's change your speaking band let's change your speaking band to 6.5 from 7 remember i haven't changed anything else right okay so now if you go down and calculate your score your score will be 399 believe me you will never get an invitation now if they said you just need a bachelor degree and one year of experience you will get permanent residency no that's wrong you will never get invitation let me show you how so let's change your degree to bachelor degree from the master degree let's put the seven band again in speaking now if you click on calculate your score your score will be 404 still it's not enough to get invitation friends believe me to get pr through the express entry you must have to score seven band in speaking reading writing and eight band in listening also you must have master degree with one year of experience or bachelor degree with four years of experience then and then you will get enough score to get permanent residency invitation now if you are not a single you are married what it will make a change let's see that so as soon as you select married in place of single it will add two more questions first is is your spouse or partner a canadian citizen or permanent resident definitely your answer will be no the next is will your spouse or partner come with you canada again definitely your answer will be yes now if you go upside down the 11th question is about your partner education let's assume he or she has a master degree The next question is about their work experience here the thing need to be noted only canadian experience of your partner will be counted so answer is none or less than a year also your partner need to appear for the language test good thing is he or she has need to score more than five band only for for the calculation let's put six band in each so six in speaking six in listening six in reading six in writing 
so now if you hit calculate score button you will ended up with 400 which indicate your partner education and language test result will not make big impact only principal applicant can do so i hope you got my point now you can also calculate your score by yourself still if you have any question any doubt regarding the point calculation or the express entry system or the canadian pr you can ask me your question in the comment section i will definitely get back to you please note i am not an agent i just try to help you guys if you like my video do like share and subscribe thank you